I was given information that there was a possible scam, uh, theft scam occurring in Salina, and that the victims were all from out of state. However, the suspect was here in Salina, and the thefts were actually occurring here in Salina. And the, from the information I was given, uh, the, Salina, the Special Enforcement Bureau, the Drug Task Force, but the Special Enforcement Bureau opened a case on it. Uh, the information we had received was that at least eight people from out of state had been scammed out of thousands of dollars in some type of internet scam. Uh, I made contact with six of the eight victims and uh, all the six people that were contacted did confirm that they had been scammed after trying to sell property on uh, Craigslist. They were all scammed in, in almost identical manners and uh, from their information, we continued investigating it. Uh, the suspect is a Simone, S-A-M-O-N-E. Her middle name is Antoinette, A-N-T-O-I-N-E-T-T-E. -T -T -E. And her last name is Wortham, W-O-R-T-H-A-M. She is 51 and resides at 619 South Santa Fe Apartment D is in David. The uh, victims of the scam advised that they were selling items on Craigslist and had uh, received money orders for the purchase of their item. However, the money orders were uh, in amounts that much exceeded what their asking price was. Uh, an example, they were one of them was selling a hundred dollar item, and they received a money order for nine hundred and seventy five dollars. Uh, they would then receive a phone call, uh, kind of frantic phone call from the buyer, claiming that their assistant or someone in, involved with them had sent the wrong money order, and asked that they please use that money to cover the cost of their item, and please return the rest of the money as soon as possible back to them through uh, Western Union. At that point, the victims were made to feel almost like a theft, a thief themselves, if they didn't return this money as soon as absolutely possible. And all the six victims I spoke with did just that. They didn't wait any time at all <coughs> to allow the money orders to clear their bank before they sent money back to these people, and then they were contacted by their bank and told that they were fraudulent money orders and that they had been scammed. Uh, yesterday, the Special Enforcement Bureau made an arrest of Simone Wortham and uh, during a search of her apartment, evidence was found that uh, corroborates just what we had thought as far as the scam and the, the Western Union money grams were concerned. Uh, we believe that there's other people involved with her doing this and that it's been going on for approximately three to four months, at least three to four months. Uh, seized in the, in the search of her house were uh, money orders that are, we have, these have not been counted yet because they, I'm on a fingerprinted. However, I believe they're going to exceed $50,000 worth of, they made out money grams that uh, were identical to what the six victims received in the mail. Uh, they are spot on identical. They were all made out for $975. Uh, I'll bring one of them out if you want to take a picture of it. Yeah. Did you lay it on top of the... The, the pile there, sorry. 